Okay, today we start with the purification of alumina through diagram. So first of all, you can see a very simple diagram here. From here, we actually have bauxite, and then we have hot concentrated NaOH. So after that, you can see that we have a filter funnel. In here, we have the residue. The residue will be your basic oxide, which is your TiO2 and Fe2O3. Being a basic oxide, it cannot dissolve in a hot concentrated NaOH. So then, now we proceed to see the filtrate. The filtrate is actually soluble in our concentrated NaOH. Inside the filtrate, we have aluminate ion, which is AlOH4 minus, and our silicate. This is called as our silicate. And this one name is as aluminate ion. So we can see that actually both of the oxides, acid oxide will actually dissolve in the hot concentrated NaOH. Then we proceed to the another step. Just now we have the filtrate. So what we do is the filtrate we can add in with any kind of acid represented by H plus. Okay. After that, we will get AlOH3, which is named as your aluminium hydroxide. So in the lab, how we can know that it's actually aluminium hydroxide? It's actually very easy. We can see a white gelatinous precipitate. After that, in order to get a pure alumina, we actually need to heat it. Usually, we heat it around 1000 degrees Celsius to 1200 degrees Celsius. After that, you will get a pure alumina.